This movie <laughs> had me on the floor laughing. Thank you. Seriously, Thank you. so funny. How much improv went down on set? Honestly, That's a good question. It wasn't a whole lot. That's like, a lot. listen, let's just go ahead and give Greg White and Sean Dwyer their hey, props. These two writers ups. put their foot into this film, and not only did they find ways, and not only did they find ways to make the film funny, but they also found ways to keep it authentic and yes. genuine. So credit to them boys. And you know, we did a little bit of improv here and there, but for yeah, the most but part. But it was mostly a really, yeah. really true script. Well, It really was, yeah. which speaks to their empathy as writers, which of, of course every artist has to have empathy. That's really the engine that drives us, but they were able to speak authentically from a, from a different culture, which is quite impressive. Speaking of culture, I do want to say that um, why, although there are movies that are surrounded around black families, mm -hmm. why did you feel it was important and necessary for culture to have a movie that represented a black single dad who's raising four kids? Uh, well, partly it's because it's my life. You know, my dad was a single dad. He met his version of Roxy. It's just me and my brother, but he met his version of Roxy. And I was raised with a step-parent. And, you know, um, he really did his best to keep us, you know, healthy and alive and, and, and functional in, in, in the best way that he could. And I kind of felt like that is a story that's, that's, that's rarely told within the black community. Very true. And so I, it was like my pleasure to step in and be like, yo, I know this dude. Yes. Yeah, yeah. And also to have a, 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 a black family with a single dad at the head. Um, in a place of uh, success as well, you know, that's where we start this film out at and that's where we end It's, it's yeah. a, you know, it's a different type of success True. a more um, all-encompassing success yes. But I think that that's really uh, amazing too. It's it's great for everyone to see uh, You know black families in a place of privilege even if they're having to question their viewpoints and beliefs around it Right and yeah, and to be honest, I still struggle with the fact that is it privilege or is it earned? Oh uh, yeah. You know what I'm saying? I mean, yeah. yeah. But I, but I understand. The, yeah, the yeah. yeah. I, I mean, from a global perspective. Absolutely. Right. Yeah. Of course. Yeah. Of course. And there was such a sweet scene where everyone has on hooded onesies. Oh yeah, yeah. Are there any unique traditions that you guys participate in? Well, you know what? I speaking of that, since since we have have it out there now, I, I can say that yes, we do do the pajamas as well. Oh, yes. yeah, I know that. it's usually just me, my husband, and my son. She I didn't want to like, that I, was, I was holding yeah. it, you know. But since yeah. it's out there yeah. now, right. yeah, yeah. I, we we do do the jammies. Yeah, we yeah. do the jammies. In my family, okay. it's straight. You know, my family's Caribbean. You know, we got. East Indian, Venezuelan, Trinidadian. We love that. The That's men cook. Incredible. The yeah. men cook in the holiday. That's what we do. Our right. tradition is the Ooh. men cook. Exactly. You ain't a man until you learn how to cook in my family. Dude, invite right. us. <laughs> right. You know what I'm saying? Done. <laughs> and we got to talk about the cute little twins. Oh my yes. God. Yes. Oh, Was yeah. this their first movie? I don't, I don't know. think so. I Selena know. and I, no, I, I think yeah, that they're they quite experienced. They, quite a bit, they yeah. are yeah. incredible. What was it like working with them? For oh, real. On, listen, you got two gymnasts, okay? Yeah, straight up. <laughs> on straight up, set, straight up. very physical gymnasts. On set all day, yeah. energy never goes down. Never. Oh my god. And it was very it was actually inspiring because they were so disciplined and so prepared and so ready to work when they showed up to set. Best attitude. Their family happens to be from the same place that my family's from. Yeah. So that was just another level of like where we eating this weekend type thing. Yeah. It was beautiful. And yeah. the other kids as well. Like oh, they yeah. were I mean, everybody just came with it. And yeah. especially them. We were we would just watch them and say, like, yeah. Man, you guys are in this story. <laughs> really, yeah. It's so true. And they, you know, also when sometimes when sometimes when you're a kid, your role is just kind of to do cutesy things as mm -hmm. a kid. But no, these kids got to be probably the more edgy people in the they film. They really did, yeah. <laughs> right? Which right. was hilarious, right? They were saying the craziest stuff. They and, were, right. they and were the best. Their execution was too good. I was like, really this was. has got to be you. This has got to be you. Mom Ma <laughs> was like... I know, yeah, Amar was in it. It's, 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 I'm telling you, it was, yeah. it was amazing. And so was Daisha. It was, it was like... Yeah. They we hats off to all of them. Well, hats off to you guys. Thank you guys did an incredible you. job. Thank really you so much. <laughs>